Hello. I installed the WF view on the Raspberry Pi, which is here. And uh, USB is connected with USB cable to X6100. And uh, I'd like to demonstrate uh, WF view running on Raspberry Pi controlling X6100. We just a simple source code change. You can with view compatible with X6100. WS view is at the latest uh, version, which is 1.66.1. Previously, I recorded an uh, old version of the WF view and uh, I wanted to try with the new version and uh, I compiled I edited the source code on just one source code I install it uh, we build it and uh, I'll show if it works first Take a look at the console SSH to Raspberry Pi. So I run the command to see which port Raspberry Pi recognizes that uh, X6100 is connected. Uh, let's run WF view. Okay, uh, so this is the configuration on WF view. Use serial and uh, you need to check both boxes and 88 is 7100 AC7100 CI really address. To choose a serial device which was shown in the, the terminal command uh, terminal and the bold red is this. And uh, let's change the 60 meter changes and mob uh, change also works. There's a little latency uh, delay, a little bit, but. Most of the time, it's not. Uh, it's not a problematic. The volume control works. Uh, transmit power change also works So if you click on about, it's 1.6.6.1.61. Unfortunately, WFU still doesn't officially support X6100. Uh, with the modification, you can make WF form working with X sixty one hundred. 
and instead of running on ARMV, exactly one on ARMV, I think uh, uh, Raspberry Pi is uh, the, perform the performance is much better and uh, it's tiny enough. I don't mind carrying this extra box. Uh, everything could be the remote, I don't have to really carry monitor except my computer to control both Raspberry Pi and uh, actually, yeah, that's it. I mean, um, running a uh, view. Um, um, controlling the WFU through the computer. So all I need is these three things, Raspberry Pi, X6100, and the computer. Uh, that's all for now. Uh, please subscribe to my uh, channel if you like my video. Thank you.